What's up, mechanics? We're on day 16. Well, actually, day 17, but I'm, I'm a day behind. So, we're on day 16 of Veganuary. I'm so proud of you guys. What we're doing today is some vegan jackfruit. Yes, vegan jackfruit. It's about to be on and popping. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Subscribe now before you steal this recipe because it's going to be that damn good. So first you start off with your all-purpose flour. Uh, I used about a cup here. Uh, the all-purpose flour has uh, some seasoning in it. I'll put the seasoning in the description. Then I add about two cups of unsweetened almond milk. Uh, I want it to be like a pancake batter, you know, kind of consistency. So if it doesn't look like this, maybe need to add a little bit more almond milk or with whatever unsweetened milk you use. Next, I take my jackfruit. I let my jackfruit drain. You know, this is from canned jackfruit. So I let it drain for a little while. But then, you know, you pour it right in your pancake batter mix, but it's not pancake batter. It's it's breading or batter, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> but you, you just go ahead and mix that on around like I did. So, you know, this is where you add all your seasonings to that batter already. So next you get some flour, lightly season your flour. I will also put in the description what I have in the flour down below. It's just a little basic seasoning mix there. But at the same time, you wanna get your pan uh, ready with some oil so that you can put your battered and floured jackfruit inside of it. So I just cook it for about five, six minutes, medium to high heat. Uh, I just did it to the outside coating was a nice color. You know, it's a fruit, so it's not like you have to cook it to a certain temperature for it to be safe to eat or anything like that. You know, oddly enough. So uh, this thing cooks down pretty good. It will have a fruity taste if you don't like leave it sit in some salt water for a while. It might have like a little sweet taste to it. So I just left it in salt water before I, I actually fried it up. But that's what you have right there. That's when you know you're done. It tastes pretty good. Make you some dipping sauce, you know, ketchup, hot sauce, what have you. Those are some uh, Orida waffle fries here. Those things are delicious, really delicious. I really do hope that you guys smash this recipe. Like it was pretty good, you know. I I'm probably won't eat it every day, but it's good. You know what I mean? This is one of those meals that you can throw in your repertoire. I hope I said that right. But anyway, guys, don't forget to eat grass, not ass like subscribe share this with your friends keep telling me how your journey's going drop it in the comments below yeah i love you guys peace out